Cheers. And I'm going to show you how to take cracked corn and turn it into cornmeal with a blender. Hi, it's Jeff with Backyard Birds. I'm going to show you how to take cracked corn and turn it into cornmeal that's used in my homemade suet recipe. And I'll put a link in the video for that recipe. Let's get started. So, we're starting with cracked corn. This is cracked corn. It's also called corn chop. Um, I purchased it at a feed store. And I'm going to take it and grind it to a finer consistency. So, to make our cornmeal, we're going to use a blender. I, I bought this blender at a thrift store. So, I find it's best just to do a couple cups of corn, cracked corn at a time. So I'm just going to put it in the blender. And we'll start the blender pro blending process. And I like to hold down on the blender so it doesn't come loose. So we'll turn it on high and watch it blend. And it's blended. You can just watch as it blends. You can see it's turned into corn meal. And so I'll just show you. And there's some that always sticks in the bottom of, the, of this blender. So I just uh, tap on it and get it to come out. So this is the corn after I blended it. And you can see it's got, it's got some larger pieces in it. But that will be fine for the suet I'm going to make with it. But if you want to chop it up finer, just blend it longer. One of the big benefits of making your own cornmeal is it has not been degerminated. It's got, it's the whole kernel of corn. So you have all the nutrition of the germ. That's been removed when you buy cornmeal at the grocery store because they need to extend the shelf life of it. So to compare prices, let's say it's six or seven dollars for 50 pounds of cracked corn. Uh, and it's about three or four dollars for say four pounds of cornmeal from the grocery store. You can see there's a pretty big savings. Plus it's a better product um, for the birds. So it's, it, to me it's a win-win situation. So thanks for watching this video. I hope you liked it and learned something. If you did learn something or have any comments, leave a comment down below. Uh, make sure you like the video and share it with your friends. I'll see you next time on the Backyard Birds channel.